Hey everyone, Rich from High Level How To here, and today we're going to be talking about a secret feature of High Level. And as ever in this secret features mini series, it's not really secret, no one's trying to hide it, but this is a feature that I think not many people know about, and if they know about it, they aren't using it to its full extent, and that is URL redirects. Can be really powerful make things look so much more professional across sites. So let's dive right in. If we want to access our URL redirects, we come down here to settings and we find a menu on the left, which is URL redirects. And to add a redirect, we hit the button here. We choose a domain. So of course we have to have some domains linked in. So let's choose this one here and we may want to say here we put in the thing that we want. So in this case, we are going to use this here, funneljustin.com, and it's going to be forward slash demo test. Uh, and then we can use the type of redirect. Could be a URL, which is what we'll go for, but we could also direct it to a specific uh, funnel or something else. In this case, we'll go URL. And we put that in there and click the redirect button. And now we've got our redirect showing up. Now, if someone goes to funneljustin.com forward slash demo test, they're going to get redirected to the Automation Geeks website. So far, so simple. If you have done a lot of WordPress development, very similar to pretty links and those kinds of things. But why would you want to set these things up? The first thing that I think is really useful about URL redirects is where you are wanting to send clients and users to a website address that looks really crazy and messy. For example, a Google Doc. If you're sending them to a Google Doc link, something like that, you will know that can be really long. It doesn't look that appealing. You can just put that into a URL redirect, have something really simple and nice as your path. It just looks a little bit more professional. Second thing maybe is affiliate links. If you or your clients are working with people who have lots of affiliate links to other services, to other websites, you can create your own links for that with forward slash uh, ClickUp or forward slash Miro, whatever services you are using. Then use your URL redirect to point to that Again, it just looks a little bit cleaner and a bit tidier and therefore more professional. And a third use is if a URL is changing. Now you might say, where does uh, a URL change? One of our use cases is with a link to join Slack and Slack at the moment recycles that link every 30 days. So we have a use case where we set that up add the redirect, we put that link in there, we've got our domain forward slash join Slack. And then we just have to set a reminder for ourselves to update that as the website link from Slack gets changed. But we're not having to update our records for users, that's join Slack, that's constant, that's consistent, that looks neat and tidy. We can just change it on the back end and users don't need to see that. And we haven't got the hassle of going around in all the places that we use it to update it. So editing is just here. You can just press that, come in, change whatever you need to change, and you are done. So that is URL redirects, a really powerful and simple tool, but one that's often overlooked. Now, if you've been seeing this system and you're thinking that you'd like to find out more, I can give you two weeks free as a trial. Head to ghltrial.com, link down below and on the screen right now, ghltrial.com. And there you can set up an account and get started and play around with all these features and see if high level is for you. If you found this video helpful, love it if you could give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button so you can be notified of more videos. And if there are other secret or hidden features, underappreciated things in high level that you would love to uh, share with everyone else or know more about, drop a comment down below.